Hello world, I'm Makap, welcome back to UFO Enemy Unknown. We are here, you know, just looking at the world. Everything is going fine. Let's just let time pass and see what happens. Yeah, we got our medikits going to South America, that is nice. Ooh, a landed UFO. Ooh, in... Uh, okay, okay, so what we're gonna do now is we're gonna send our European interceptors just to hang around there. And we're gonna wait... So we're not gonna go there at, during night time. Let's go a bit closer, actually. Because if the... No, actually, getting close makes it harder to see when night time is over. So yeah, if if it's gonna stay down until morning comes here, we're gonna send our Sky Ranger there. But otherwise, because uh, we'll, we're gonna shoot it down with the interceptors if it tries to get up. Okay, large rockets in Europe. Well, that's nice. Let's put the rockets on the sh uh, Sky Ranger. Couple of rockets there. Can we put the tank there? Nope. Also need to add a couple of guys here. Actually, do we need to send the rookies there? No, rookies can stay behind. That's fine. Oh, and let's actually check that everyone has armor. Well, some people don't have armor, so let's give them armor. Let's give even these guys who are standing here armors. They're supposed to have armor. And let's send our Sky Ranger over there. Ooh. Okay, this could be quite interesting. Okay, where is the line? Actually, we might be getting there a little bit too early. Just patrol there for a couple of minutes. Let's make sure that it's daytime. Okay, now it's surely daytime there already. And go there now. Go there. There. Thank you. Okay. So this is gonna be a hard mission for sure, because all the aliens are gonna be alive, like every single one of them. Not even one is gonna be dead to begin with. Ah, that's nice, we're gonna have loads of them around here, for sure. Hmm. Uh. So once again, Emil starts with the rocket launcher and a smoke grenade and everyone else just gets the heavy plasma. Okay, we're immediately seeing some of its mutons. An uncrashed ship of mutons. Okay, well, we're almost in a corner, so that's good. Okay, which way are you looking? You're looking that way, so you are not seeing us at this moment, so that's good. We can actually get out of the ship without you taking a reaction shot, because first I want to see if there are any other mutons right here. Okay, don't, there doesn't seem to be. We need to send some guys this way, that's for sure. So, sh oh, not there. That was a misclick. Oh! Well, Shuji should. Please hit again, please hit again. No, oh, yes! Ah, thanks, Shuji. Ooh. Right. Right, 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 right. I am really scared here. Okay, let's see. He is looking that way, so he's seeing this way and that way. So... I'd really like to throw a grenade, like, here, just in case. Actually, I think I'm gonna do that. Klaus, you take your alien grenade in hand, prime it to explode at the end of this turn, and throw it here. Come on, you can throw it here. You're strong enough to get it here, aren't you, man? You gotta be... Oh, man. Oh! There's a, there's a mutant right there. Can you throw it here, then? Come on, man. You're... 
that you're being blocked by this part here, most likely. Damnation! Okay, you can throw it now. Now you can throw it. Yes! And that might also mean that some of these wheat fields get destroyed, so we can move here more freely. We're, we're not gonna trust that grenade to kill that muton, that's for sure, but at least it's... Well, uh, at least it's something. Uh, let's take Lester here first. Get out. And Lester, how accurate are you? 62, that's pretty accurate. Ah, uh, so... Take a shot! And... Please kill him, please kill him. No, and now he's gonna turn and kill Lester. Yep. Oh, that was a miss! Oh! Miss, miss, still, miss, miss! Ah, yes! Ooh. Lester, come on, Lester. Oh yes, thank you, Lester. Wow, we ah, uh, so we get time units to sp for anything. So you go, uh, you go and see if there's anyone here. Oh, you can't even turn. Mm, we'll stay there. Who do we have here? Maria. Uh, yeah, you're seeing that guy. Yes, yes, yes. Uh, take a couple of steps forward. And should we just try the trust in the grenade? Because if we shoot at this guy. And he turns, he's gonna kill some. You know what? Let's trust in the grenade. You know, if... If, you know... If it doesn't kill this guy, at least we'll be sh You know, we'll know it for sure that they aren't good enough to kill these guys. Okay, Emil... We're not gonna use you, we're gonna use... Kyle here first. Yeah, and we're gonna save time units, so... We're gonna hope that this guy dies with a grenade, but if he doesn't, maybe he's gonna turn, he's gonna shoot someone. And then we're gonna hope that the other guys are gonna take a reaction shot and, you know, avenge that death. Wait, is this 5 times 5 or 4 times 4? It's a 5 times 5 map. And this is... what type? Oh my! Oh my! Oh my! It's a pretty large ship! So the amount of aliens, since we didn't even crash that ship, might be quite a bit massive. There could be loads of aliens here. Oh, Lester, you are in the way there. Uh, okay, so we got you guys check that corner. You guys maybe next turn we're gonna go check that house. Uh, we're gonna need to send people towards this ship. Uh, Bernard, you come here. Go here and then come here. Okay, you stay there then. Mm. Micheline, you're not gonna have enough time to do anything smart this turn, so... Go here, and start coming this way. Where is that? Okay, so this guy can see... to about somewhere here. Okay, you guys can still come down here. Ah! So many places where aliens could be hiding. Boris, uh, you can this way as well. And Emil, you step there, uh, prime that grenade, take two steps forward, and throw that grenade. 
here. Right. At least we got some smoke cover. So maybe, maybe that guy, if he doesn't die from the grenade, won't see us in the smoke. Uh, go through here, please. You can take more steps as you can. One more step. Ivan, one. Come here. Whoa, you can't see this guy. How is that even possible? So sort of like there must be like some tree right there just blocking. Ah, uh, Rudy, you don't have enough time units to do anything smart this turn, so just spend all of them. And head this way. Right, and that's all of you guys, so let's hope, let's hope that the grenade kills him. It didn't! Oh man! <laughs> well, let's hope that he's so wounded that he, uh, he can't hit any of our guys. Okay, so there's... Well, it's a big ship, there's gonna be lots of agents within the ship, so... Oh! No, 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 who's dead? Oh! Oh man. Also, that was a normal door opening. Yeah. Lots of people. Lots of people moving within the UFO. Or maybe they're just walking between one door, in and out of one door. Oh. Well, okay, this wasn't that massively long, that alien turn. Okay, so we saw one alien here, and we know there's one alien here. Uh, you know what, let's do the easy parts first. You guys over here, check out that there ain't no one here. Oh, there is someone here, because there's an open door! Oh, no, no! No, 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 Well, Tetsuo, you didn't get shot, so no line of fire. How is there no line of fire? He shot you, well... Do you have line of fire from this square? No? Well, can you shoot here? How do you not have a line of fire? About oh no! No! God damn it! Ah. Oh, didn't you mean to press there? That was the wrong square. Would you have a line of fire from there? Come on, you need to have a line of fire from somewhere. Okay. Please. No! No, no, no! The two! Two of them over there! Okay. Uh, who are you? Shuji? Okay. Go here. Shoot at that guy. At least he's in front of the window, so you can actually kill him. Please. Oh, thank you. And then the other guy as well. Come on, man. You can do it. Oh, yes. What? Oh, my God. This is crazy. Why did you... Like, look at this. There's four of these guys have been in here. Oh, man. Insanity. Well, that's four dead aliens, at least, so probably like one fifth of the guys that are here. So that's good. Where is that guy from here? Come on. Come on. Come on. Oh, there's the door to the UFO. How are you not seeing that guy? Where could he have gone? Well, we're going to... Actually, uh, so the range is well, about the size of one square, so let's use Ivan here to throw a grenade, because if one grenade didn't kill him, two should. So let's throw a grenade like here, if he's like somewhere here, hiding somewhere here, then he'll die by next turn. 
right. Uh, go hide behind that tree, Ivan. Oh, you don't have enough time to get there. Hmm. Alright, and we saw one alien over here. Oh. Uh, bloody hell. Okay, Rudy, you can see that guy. Uh, do we have anyone who's a bit more accurate around here? How accurate are you actually? 55. Bernard, you are 60. Klaus, 56. Shaleen, 54. Boris, you just stay there. Shuji, you're done for this turn. Lester, no, not that button. This button. 62. Ah, uh, so Lester's the most accurate guy around here. You know what? It's gonna be Lester taking the shot. Please don't shoot your friend in the back, though. <sighs> Looks really close to shooting your friend in the back there. Okay. And another one. Oh, come on, how come he ain't dead? But then again, he didn't take a reaction shot, so I'm gonna shoot with Rudy now. Okay, thank you, Rudy. Uh, do you have enough timings for... Well, you have enough for a snapshot, so just stay there. And Mikhail, you stay there. Oh, Mikhail, you've been shot! Well, no, you're not. What am I looking? I'm looking at your time units, <laughs> not your health. Ah, uh, Donald, uh, go here. Uh, I'm scared that there might be some aliens here. Mm. Okay, take a step this way and then come here. Just stay there. Uh, Bernard. Actually, let's take Micheline here first. Micheline, you go here. Okay. Klaus. You come this way as well. Turn this way. Let's start take a couple of steps forward. Olga, you can take one step forward. Emil. Okay, let's think. Is there any place we'd just like to shoot, like directly with Emil, just to explode things? Actually, I don't think we want to do that as to, like, he's the last guy. We're gonna want to do that at the beginning of next turn, maybe. So, Emil, you go hide, like, behind this tree here. If you have more time, just go hide behind this tree. Right, and next turn we can like, destroy this building here. Maybe. Oh, we still got Bernard here. Uh, Bernard, 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 go. Try to get here. Okay. Is that all? That's everyone. Now that grenade's gonna explode here first. And... Well, it didn't kill everyone, so that one alien is... Still somewhere. Oh, God. Just. Okay, that was once again some normal doors opening. So we have some sort of idea where at least one alien is. And. Well, at least. There's. Oh! Please! Hit him! Hit him! Oh! Uh, I think that was a hit. So. Oh, come on, Donald, how come you ain't seeing him now? You just saw that guy here! Well, you know what? This is what Emil is here. Why Emil is here. So, Emil, come here. And take an aim shot. At about here. So, if there's an alien somewhere here, he's gonna be dead. No? What in the world is going on? Uh, okay, let's let's start with these guys here. Uh, yeah, Emil, go hide behind the tree again. Actually, turn this way. 
and right. But now let's start with these guys. Olga, come here. Look inside. There's no one there. Come here. Make sure there's no one hiding behind the door. Doesn't look like it. Uh, you guys need to save for an auto shot because we heard doors opening, so it could be here or it could be here. Uh, okay, come here. You go through the house, and Klaus, you go from behind. And Shuji, we don't really need you to do anything right now. We're gonna start with Rudy here. Rudy's gonna go check the orchard there. And let's check this way as well. Okay, reserve for a snapshot, turn this way, and Lester's gonna go check the inside of this building. Okay, and then you guys need to find these aliens from here, like there was someone right there. Well, now you're seeing someone. It's right there. How oh, didn't it die from the explosion? Come on! Okay. Okay, now it's dead. Ah. Hmm. Okay, Mikhail. Yeah, you go towards that house there. Boris. Uh, Come here, and here, and this way. I'll get you done for this turn. Shuji, you come here as well. And uh, here you go. Ivan, you wait a bit still. Bernard. Here, here, and you stay there. Yeah, that's where you need to stay. Donald, come here, go here, turn this way, stay there. Ivan, are you the last one? Yeah, you're the last one. Uh, so you go towards the UFO as well. You can use all of your time units. Come here. Okay. And next turn. Action within the UFO. That's, well, at least it's not action outside of the UFO. Oh, no! No, 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 no. What is... No! No. Okay, so... I'm pretty sure we saw a grenade being thrown from the... How, top of that one building. So... Yeah. Oh, but it didn't kill. It didn't kill. Did it maim? But Rudy, you didn't even take any damage! Wow! Okay, so that grenade... Yeah. It must have come from the roof. Yep, from the roof. Can you shoot at the guy on the roof? You can. Good. Just drop in. Come on. Come on. Hit him. Yes! Wow. I can, like, surviving a grenade. Like, and it was, like, seriously. The grenade was here. That's pretty close. Oh, no, actually here. Three squares away. And he didn't take any damage. It's insane. So apparently, actually, how good are our armors? Like, that's... 
I wonder which way was she looking. Who's looking this way, so probably like front or side armor, so 50 or 40 armor. I don't even know what that armor means, to be perfectly honest. Like, is it a percentage amount? Is it a direct amount of how much damage it pre prevents or what? I don't know. I could probably read that from online somewhere. Okay, and we saw someone here. Mm. Mm. Ah, let's move these guys first. This uh, is <laughs> less scary team. Okay, you come here, Micheline. Open the door. Turn. Uh, save for a snapshot, please. Wait, one of these guys was hit, wasn't he? Ooh, Donald! Ooh, you really, really need uh, some healing. Emil, you have... A no, you don't! Who did I give them to? Actually, I can use this here, right? Uh, who's got a medikit? No one who's got time units left this turn. Mm. Okay. Donald, just run this way like as much as you can. And let's hope that one of these guys has... Or wait, was that everyone? Actually, let's see. Donald, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Okay, so the people who had the medikits were the ones who are dead? What? Did I just... No one has medikits. And no one has the motion scanner either. What is this madness? We've only lost one guy, haven't we? What's that? That's a mutant corpse. Yeah, we only lost this guy. Okay, so... I'll go, go check if this guy had medikit with him. He did! Okay, take that medikit. And start heading towards Donald. Okay, I should have just moved this way with him. Oh well. Boris, you save for... Uh, Auto shot, you come here. Actually, and you should stay there. Shuji, come here. Stay there. Mm. Uh, Bernard. Oh, I wonder, would you have enough? Time units to prime and throw an explosive right here. That might be the like the best idea. Let's see. Oh, it says, yes, you have. So prime it to explode this turn and throw it right here. Oh, don't throw it on the roof. Oh, you threw it right where you should. Thank you. And Ivan, you need to go like here. Actually, go here, so the aliens can see you from this way, and if someone comes out, you still have time. No. Oh, they're gonna shoot you in the back! Uh, Mikhail, you come here. And you, you cover, cover for Ivan. Okay, is that everyone? Oh, Emil is still here. Emil... Just walk this way. Mm, should we send? Oh no, no, no! We know here. No one's here. Ah. Uh, okay. Did you kill that alien node? We didn't hear the dying sound, so of course it's not dead. And it's gonna kill. Oh, maybe it won't kill anyone. Maybe it'll miss. Oh, it only shot once. 
So we're ho let's hope that it's so damaged that it can't really hurt anyone. Okay. Uh, okay, I'm really confused. Have, have we lost someone besides this guy? I don't think we have, but... Like... So th this, this is how good memory... Like the... How good my memory is. I don't remember things like this. Uh, Mikhail... Okay. Why is there... A weapon there? Oh. Bloody hell! This is not a good spot to end your turn. Ivan. Okay, there's that guy. Please kill him. Thank you, Ivan. And now you need to turn that way. Yep. Oh, let's actually take care of Donald. Because he's gonna die in a couple of turns if we don't get him to the medikit. Like, he's got five health left. He's gonna be at two next turn, so... We might just be able to save him. Like, just, yeah. You have that thing, don't you, Olga? Yes, you do. Okay. Okay, yeah, we're gonna be able to save him. He's not gonna die. That's good. Oh, he might fall unconscious, though. Mm, well, let's hope he doesn't. Okay, Boris. Now let's start from this side. And actually, Klaus, take a step back. Make sure there's no one there. There's no one there. Search for an auto shot. Come here. Make sure there's no one there. Okay, there's no one here. Okay, you stay there. Uh, Micheline. Okay, no one there. There's probably no one here. But, you know... <laughs> I don't want to take extra risks. I need to check every corner and go check the upstairs too. Shuji, start heading towards the UFO. You actually don't need to reserve for anything, just head there. Mew, you wait a bit. Bernard, just go here, stay here. Mm. Yeah, you wait there. We get one a good breach happening. Lester. Go upstairs here, check the corners, no one's there. Go to this room. I should have, you know, stopped here. But, oh well. Rudy, just make sure there's no one in the orchard. Doesn't look like there is. And just come here, move around the UFO just in case. Emil. Mmm, we really don't want you shooting at this time. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna put you here. And we're gonna give you... Now we're gonna make you look the other way, just in case. And... Yeah, that's... Ooh, Boris is still here. Boris, come towards the UFO. And that's this turn. What are the aliens gonna do? Okay, they're moving within the UFO. And... They're... Okay, I'm pretty sure that all of the aliens that are left are within the UFO. And Donald, come here. Olga, heal him. Yeah. Oh. Okay, so Donald's not dead. That's nice. Uh, actually, we're gonna. Olga's gonna drop this to the ground, and Donald's gonna pick that up. So, he's gonna be our medic now. 
if anyone else gets wounded, they just need to go to Donald, so Donald pick it up. And also go get that motion scanner from this dead dude. Have we lost two guys? Like, I don't remember who else we would have lost here. Uh, you guys are done for this turn, you guys. Uh, actually, Mikhail, just go here. Check this place just in case. Okay, there doesn't seem to be anyone there. So, ooh! Right, should have checked this way as well. And Ivan, you go here, wait for a breach. You guys, now you need to save for an auto shot and come here. Okay. And Shuji, you too. I guess just wait there. You guys uh, don't really need to do anything this turn. Maybe we should give a grenade to Emil and just have him prime it and hold it in hand so that once we open the door he could just throw it inside. Actually, let's see, can we see? Because I don't remember the uh, layout of this particular type of UFO, so... You can see that there's uh... Okay, so there's a wall right there. So no, I don't think we want any of those explosives in there, it's pretty tight corners. You check out this place. Okay, no one here, it seems. Lester, just make sure there's no one in the corner. Okay, and then head to the roof. And go check the orchard. And Klaus, check this place here. Okay, there's no one here. Okay, so. I think we can be uh, pretty sure that there are no aliens outside the UFO left. Now Rudy, just, you know, go around the UFO just in case. Okay, that's everyone. And, yeah. Yeah, there's only aliens within the UFO left, that's for sure. Uh, okay, Rudy. Just walk around the UFO. Just to be absolutely 100% sure. Ivan, get a bit closer. Bernard, you too. Boris, go through this spot. Oh, actually, let's put the rookie there. And yeah, we're gonna wait here until we get a bit more guys here. Okay, Mikhail, you come here. And Klaus, you too. Actually, you can move still one step, couldn't you? Yes. And Olga, come here. Right, and Donald, you go get the motion scanner. And come this way. And Micheline, check this room. No one here. Check this room. Check behind the door. There's no one there. Go to the roof. Now Lester, just come here and make absolutely sure there's no one there. Okay. Now just jump down. And come towards the UFO. So, is that everyone? That's everyone. The aliens, yeah. They're all within the UFO. Now, it's one of those things that, once again, I'm thinking that with my luck, what they're gonna do is they're gonna have... Oh, there's another door here! I completely forgot that this type of UFO has two doors. Well, that means... Uh, let's have five guys be a part of this bridge team. Actually, let's send send you guys. You're fast enough to get here maybe this turn. Yeah, send a couple of you guys here. And... Mikhail as well. 
Okay, and put you guys here. Just wait here with all of these guys till all of the rest of the guys come here because if there's two doors, well, then I need two breach teams and I want them both breaching at the same time. Oh, not enough energy. Wow. Uh, Lester, come here. And Donald, well, you're not going to be part of either of the breach teams, so we got what? We got only. Uh, let's check the map to make sure. Oh, yeah, we have. Uh, who was it we have here? Was it Michelin? Yeah, Michelin's still here. So, we get two more guys heading towards the UFO that need to be part of a breach team, so I think we're going to wait until they actually get there before we breach. So, four, four, yeah, we get a uh, five-man man team to go inside, and we'll have Donald and Emil just hanging outside. Okay, and now with my turn, luck, they're going to open both of those doors, throw grenades out of them, all of my guys are going to die. Well, apparently not. Well, almost! Did they, did they manage to shoot one of our guys here? No, well... Okay, I... Since I know there's one there right now, I, I need to... I, I, I need to... I, I know this is not smart, but I need to... I need to do this right now. Kill him. And then get out. Whoa! It took nine time minutes to get out. Woo! This is one of the nicest graphics in this game, I think. So this is a mutilator ship, I wonder. Or it's, it's probably not called a mutilator ship, but... You know, they do some cattle mutilation here. Okay, you guys, just wait. And we're gonna let send Olga this way. You don't reserve for an auto shot. Why are you doing that? And Emil, you're just hang there. Lester, come here. And Donald, you come here as well. You don't have enough energy either. And Micheline, you come here. You don't have enough energy. Running out of energy here. Well. Let's hope that the aliens aren't, you know, being smart about anything. Now, Donald, uh, put that thing on your belt right now, because we don't need that. Take the motion scanner in hand. How much does it require for a scan? Fifteen, so uh, you need to... You can still take two more steps and then scan. Okay, you can't see anyone with that. Uh, okay. You guys come here, Lester and uh, Micheline here. Right. Uh, and Olga come here. Uh, Rudy, turn. And yeah, next turn we're gonna breach. And uh, so. Okay, that was a very quick turn, so maybe one or two aliens left. Okay, Donald, come here, use your scanner. Okay, you can see one, that's what is that? That would be 8, 9, 10, 11 squares. So, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Okay, so it's probably about somewhere here or on the higher floor. Well, it's time to breach. Rudy, it was nice knowing you. Don't die. Okay, you're not dead yet. Uh, come here. Come here. How much do you require for an auto shot? 17. Okay, so you stay there. Uh, Ivan. Come here. If I remember correctly, these are... Yeah! There's this annoying point about about this ship design. There's a door right there that goes like to air. Like if we had flying suits we could use that door. But 
bad thing about it is that the aliens can use they can open the door and then just shoot down from there. Which is really annoying. Okay. Ivan, you stay there. Boris. Come here, actually. Make sure there's no one there. There's no one there. Can I take one more step? Well, you need to. Because you're blocking the other guys at this point. Actually, yeah, let's let's have Rudy move here. Uh, what? You're seeing someone through the floor. You shoot at them. You can. Well, that probably means that they can shoot at you too. Mmm, that's not good. Well, sometimes some people are gonna die. Just can't be helped. Can you shoot through the floor here for that, that guy who ever this? Yes, you can. I wonder if there's like a hole in the floor here. Because we can't see holes, of course. Okay, all got. Yeah, you stay there. Okay, you guys. Prepare for a breach. That's an elevator. Uh, just go up and look at every possible corner. Can get out of the way. Come here. Right, then Klaus. You get in here, head towards this door. Wait there. Lester, come up and go towards this door. Oh, well, you're gonna have to use all of your time units. Well, not all of them, but yeah, you're not gonna have enough for a reaction shot. Bernard, let's hope you have enough for, to save for a reaction shot. Okay, you stay there, that's good enough. Meal, mm, you know what, just. You're not doing anything smart, so just run around just to use some of your time units, so that maybe you'll get more time units. And Micheline gets in. Right. Okay, next turn. We still got some aliens. Okay, maybe maybe just one. Feels like just one. Uh, Micheline. So we go here and then get out of the way. We're gonna have Donald move right here and scan. Okay, so there's someone that's like seven squares that direction, someone's three squares that direction. One, two, three. So there's someone either here or on, well, some of the upper levels. And what was seven squares this way? One, two, three, four, five. Well, somewhere on this area. Ah, so, two... Wait... Did we... S well, I think there's two aliens still here. Uh, yeah, Ivan, what do you require for an auto shot? Well, you can still step here and turn, turn this way, yes. Oh, there aren't any ways to get up from here. Hmm... Well... You guys, Klaus, it was nice knowing you. Okay, that's just an elevator down here. Well, Klaus, go check that place. What What do we have here? Well, okay, so this... Ah, well, you wait there. We're gonna send you some backup. Someone's gonna come with you there. Maybe Micheline. Except that <laughs> she doesn't have enough energy to move. But, you know, maybe she could get, well, not quite. Lester, your turn to die. Please don't. Please don't. Okay, go here and check if you can see anyone here. Nope. Then again, these are horrible places because the aliens could be hiding behind these containers. Uh, Bernard, 
you come here. Step here. Watch there. Watch here. <gasps> okay, this guy has a stun launcher, so kill the guy who's right next to you. Okay, good. Good, 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 good. And then, just to rub it in, get right on his skin. Now, <laughs> I, what's gonna happen is he's gonna have uh, another weapon, and he's gonna pull that from his pocket, and gonna shoot my guys. But then again, we could just try to shoot the door and kill him right here. Come on. Boris. Yeah! Like that, Boris. Shoot the door, please. Please, Boris. Yeah. Good job, Boris. Now we can take, like, Rudy here and Rudy... Whoa! There's someone here that Rudy can see. Oh, Rudy, shoot them. Okay. This is weird, like... Why can we see there? I don't understand. Uh, Rudy, you need to take a couple of steps. It doesn't matter, it doesn't matter, they're just unconscious. It doesn't matter at all. What matters is that this guy's going to die now. No! Did she just shoot Bernard? It just shot Bernard! Bloody hell! Olga, that's not how we work here. You, you, you need to take a snapshot now, just so you don't. Oh my God, Olga! What's wrong with you? Bloody hell! We were, we almost won this mission already, and no, you have to go and kill Bernard. I th you, you might get fired, Olga, just for that. Like what in the world? Huh, okay, that might have been the last alien. Well, it wasn't. So there's still one alien somewhere. Uh. And he's so far that Donald can't even find him with his scanner. Klaus, check this place. <gasps> We're gonna get pretty good things from this, since this is a completely intact ship. Like... S loads of Illyrium and all that other good stuff. Shuji, you need to go... here. Okay, make, just make sure there's no one in the corner, there's no one in the corner down here and uh, no up this goes up right <sighs> I'm really pissed at Olga why really he, why did you do it like he was a good guy God damn squatty. Killed one of our captains. Now Donald, uh, you go and try to wake up our unconscious dudes. Or actually, just drop the medikit, take a side step, let's have Emil do it. Pick up the medikit, and get this way. Like, Bernard was was one of the really good guys. He'd been with us for a long time. You had to go and shoot him! <sighs> I'm honestly... I, I, I don't remember when the last time I was this angry at a, you know, fictional 
thing. <sighs> Clint, you go check this corner. I probably should. Well, you don't have enough energy to move, so at least you'll be saving enough for an auto shot. Which is something that Lester should be doing as well. Right. Is that everyone? That's everyone. And. Whoa! Okay. Kill him! Yes! Then Mikhail became unconscious and Rudy became unconscious. But. Doesn't matter, that was the end of the mission. So, three of our operatives were killed. Two live aliens recovered, that's nice. Three? I like. I've completely blocked out one of our guys dying, I think. Yeah, that's just what ha must have happened. But yeah, all of this good stuff is what I was talking about. Like 100 Illyrium 115, we got almost 100 alien alloys, we got some alien surges, some alien food, we got two UFO power sources, 10 UFO navigation, all good stuff. Ooh, and loads of promotions as well. well that's nice. Ivan got to turn to the colonel. That's very good. Okay, so we lost three guys, and once again, it's just not enough equipment. Well, uh, let's purchase those three guys, first of all. Three new guys. Uh, let's have the Sky Ranger return home. Because once again, I need to make sure what don't we have enough. Because if I don't do it immediately, I'm gonna forget. So uh, we got rocket launcher. We got the rockets for it. We got the smoke grenades. We got the proximity grenades. We got the uh, oh high explosives. Hmm. Then again, do I want high explosives? Yeah, I can. I kind of like them. Okay. Yeah, so let's. We need to buy a couple more high explosives to use on next missions. Not enough store space. Well, then we need to sell stuff first. Okay, let's actually sell the regular grenades. We don't need them. Uh, let's sell eight of the heavy plasmas. Let's sell six of the plasma rifles. Uh, let's sell the corpses. Do we? Oh. Small launchers, only two. Oh yes, because yeah, there are two extra. So we got two in both of our bases, so we can sell them. Uh, we can sell all but one of the mutant corpses, and then of course we can sell the alien food and alien search. And I can only leave one of them because I don't remember if you can research them in this game or not. So yeah, I'm gonna. Oh, now transfer, purchase some high explosives, and then this is gonna be the end of this episode. We're gonna continue this next time. Not enough store space. Well, fine, let's build some more store space, and then we're gonna end this end this episode. Uh, let's just put it, like, uh, here. Right, I'm a cop. This has been UFO Enemy Unknown. Goodbye, world. Thanks for watching. See you next time.